today i've got a vegetarian recipe with potatoes and this is called as hara alu as you can see there are very few ingredients over here and it's a very simple and easy recipe so you just need to do some preparation before so one of them is uh, like i have taken about four medium sized potatoes and then cut them into quarters and then i deep fried them on a medium high flame till they were golden and fully cooked then in the hara masala i have taken a handful, handful of a fresh coriander leaves three to four green chilies or to taste three garlic cloves and three to four leaves of mint leaves uh, because i just want a small hint of um, uh, mint to my hara masala in case if you want a nice and very uh, dominant mint flavor you can definitely add some more mint leaves but uh, i just want it at the minimum and if you want to add some more more uh, nutrition to your haram masala you can add only one leaf of palak or spinach so that will add some uh, nice uh, color also and in the uh, masala i have kept it very minimum so here i have got a half teaspoon of salt and this is the black pepper which is totally optional in case if you feel the spiciness is less you may add a bit of garam uh, sorry the black pepper powder half a teaspoon of cumin seeds and then i've got sesame seeds which i'm going to use for garnishing and if you want to add any more other masala and make it more chatpata or spicy then so you the may very add. first step that i'm going to do is make a paste out of the coriander green chilies uh, and uh, garlic and the mint leaves and uh, we are going to add tablespoons a couple of tablespoons of water and make it into a nice i have heated oil in my kadai so now i'm going to add uh, the lemon has spluttered and started browning and this is the grinded paste of the greens that i had kept so now i'm going to add it the reason why we have kept our masala a bit loose is because I want the masala to go right into the potatoes and the flavor should be there into the potatoes. So now I am going to add half a teaspoon of salt in case if we need more we can we are going to add the fried potatoes and just we are going to toss it like it. Taste test I am just going to sprinkle a bit of this uh, vegetable on a high flame for just about two minutes and I'm just going to sprinkle some sesame seeds over the top and give it a quick mix and then we're just going to roast it on a high flame for about two minutes and then our vegetable is ready to so be friends here are green aloo or hare aloo is ready it's a dry vegetable you may serve it as an accompaniment with rice or dal or you may just keep it um, uh, simple with some naan so guys do give it a try post me your comments and share my videos with your family and friends and do like us on facebook and subscribe to my channel and thank you for watching my video